How do you create a superhero universe? You don't know the power of the Nerd Way. There is a lot of drama going on online here on the YouTubes uh, with independent comic book creators. And I'm not even going to go into that. That is way too much drama for me. I give up drama when I graduated high school. I don't need it. What I do want to talk about, though, is something I heard another YouTuber say while they were talking about the newest independent comic book creator uh, and what he's done. Uh, they were talking about you know, the new comic coming out. And they said, I got a quote right here. Um, it's very ambitious to want to do a whole entire superhero universe. When you create a comic book, or even a book in general, you have to consider the fact that you're probably going to create a universe. Because unless you only have a story with one hero and one villain, and that's it, then it's going to be a very boring story. But you have to have other characters and in, in, in other things in this world. So you're going to have to have a universe. Uh, Marvel and DC were great at it once. They had, they, I mean... DC really went all out with the universes and with the multiverse and crisis on infinite earths and Marvel kind of came in later with all their multiverse stuff, but they were great at it. They did a lot of good universe building, uh, a lot of independent comics have been doing it since independent comics were a thing. And Todd McFarlane leaves Marvel. He has one character, Spawn. Boom! He creates an empire out of this one comic book universe. Uh, writers. Look at Stephen King. His, his Dark Tower series. Uh, his his kind of combines his whole writing career almost as one universe. Uh, it's... it's, it's I'll, I'll tell you the secret. There, there, there is a secret. You, it's, 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 and it's not. It's not on a top ten list. You don't need a top ten list, a top five list. You don't even need a top three things to learn how to create a universe. I'm going to tell you the one thing, the one thing you need to create a universe, whether it's superhero or not. You want to create a universe. This is what you need. Imagination. That's all you need. With a good imagination, you can create anything on paper. I mean, you can't create it out of thin air. No, no, no one can do that. Unless you're a magician. I mean, you can mold stuff. I mean, yeah, you got these artists, you know, they, they, but for our purposes, on paper, whether you're writing or drawing, you can create anything with a good imagination. Now, if you have a poor imagination, you might have some ideas, but you're never going to go anywhere. You're, you're going to maybe get a step or two in, and then you're just going to stall. You need a really good imagination to take your vision, to take your idea, and move it down the line. And, again, like I said, Marvel used to do it. Marvel used to have great imagination. They used, to, they used to be called the House of Ideas. With the Marvel bullpen putting out great comics time and time again. But then they stopped with the all-new, all-different Marvel. All the creativity must have just got run out. They, they, it's like, you know what? We're no longer creating anything. We're just going to take what we got... And we're just going to shuffle it around. We're going to take all our good established characters. And we're going to race and gender swap them. And that's what you're going to get. That's all you're going to get. Is just the same character 
with a different name and face. That's not creative. That is lazy. That is, yeah, it's, it's lazy. It's, it's, it's lazy, uncreative garbage. And when they do try to create something new, when they do try to create something new, when they, when they, when they go, maybe, they end up with this. <laughs> Nobody wants that. Nobody wants that. Unless you're weird and, 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 and you like that kind of stuff, then you got issues. But yeah, I mean, you need a good imagination to create a universe. That's it. I, when I wrote my book, Deadlock, I had the entire... I had the, the entire first book thought out in my head. I had the universe mapped out in my head. I knew who all the good guys were. I knew who all the bad guys were. I knew the aliens. And when I was doing all the mapping out of my characters and things, I used the Stan Lee equation. Uh, one hero, four villains. Four villains for every one hero. Uh, so I made sure I packed a lot. I'm, I'm, as I'm going on writing, I'm packing... Way more villains than heroes. Because that's so that's it. The one thing you need to be successful in creating a superhero universe or any other universe, imagination. That's all you need. If you have a great imagination, try it. Write something. Create something. The world needs more creators. Uh... We need more comic books, good comic books. We need more good books. We need more good artists out there using their imagination, creating great things so we can enjoy them. I enjoy a good comic book. I have spun, I have done I've I've put money into crowdfunding comic books because I believe in their in, in what they're doing. Uh, I would rather give them my money than Marvel and DC right now. I don't want to give them any money because they haven't earned it. These guys have. I want to thank everyone for watching. You guys are great. Uh, please like, share this video. If I've earned your subscription today, please hit the subscribe button. If you would like to read an independent author... Buy my book, Deadlock. It's on Amazon. The link to uh, is down below. Help support a, an indie author. Uh, if you have a Kindle, uh, Kindle, you can get it for free. Uh, it's two ninety nine for the for, for the ebook. The Kindle, it's free. It's nine ninety nine for the paperback. I'll even sign your paperback. You know, if if you, buy, if you buy the book, contact me, send me a message, and I will, I will give you my address. You can send me your book. I'll sign it. I'll send it back to you. Love to do that. So what do you guys think? Is creating a superhero universe easy? Have I, have I oversimplified it? Have I undersimplified it? Let me know in the comments. Uh, and let me know if you guys have a... Uh, any independent stuff going on, any crowdfunding comic books or things coming, you know, because I'd, I'd love to know. I'd love to, you know, spend money on good stuff. Uh, I'm a small YouTuber. I could try to promote, you know, I, I'll, I'll say, hey, here's this guy. He's got this, this comic coming out. Let's all support him. I'll do my best. I mean, I'm not a huge voice right now, but I'm getting there. With your guys' help. Thank you very much. So thanks a lot, uh, and I will see you guys later.